traveling from. Germany. Really good. Yeah. Happy to see you. Thank you, man. India. I love it. I really love Not India. Traffic. traffic is awesome. <laughs> Cheers, man. Whoa. Oh, people, so nice. Hello. Well, hello. <laughs> so pretty. So pretty. So pretty. So pretty. So pretty. All right, cool. All right, so then, thank you, and and all the best for you guys, and and I see you soon. <coughs> Goodbye. All right, as you can see, I had to switch apartments because I wanted to extend, and the other one was already booked, so I came here. But it was beautiful, and the area is cool, man. Bangalore or Bengaluru is the absolute. Absolute cool city. I really enjoy it here, but the show must go on, of course. I want to go down south to Kerala, and as he was going on there, it's supposed to be so beautiful. But first, I want to meet a friend, for some breakfast, and then I'll be out and about again. Good morning, traffic. Yeah, you have a helmet now. Want to be in the video? In the video? Yeah. Oh. Saying goodbye? I don't want to see you. Though. No, you don't, you don't have to do anything. See you. I'm going to miss you. But uh, yeah, I'll text you later. Yeah. Yeah. There you are. Oh guys, it's so hard to leave this city. Especially because, you know, like, when you start making friends somewhere and I had this really good time with uh, Ultraviolet, you know, I even went there again. Two days later I met all the CEOs and then we had another test ride and uh, the founder drove Eve, which was really cool. So yeah, it is very, Sometimes it's just harder than other times to go on the bike in the morning and leave But that's just you know, that's just what you do when you're a traveler It's just how it is Can't stay in place forever Especially if I was gonna for example do like a world record That would be like impossible for me to stay longer than two weeks somewhere because otherwise I couldn't make the record but that is also why I don't do any records I'm just traveling but anyways today I'm trying like depending on how long it takes me now to get out of the city I want to go to the coast and look at that all these yellow flags I just learned that there's today like a temple opening in the north somewhere so there's a lot of this is basically a holiday everywhere, but yeah, I'm going to see a lot of yellow flags and I'm not exactly sure what the yellow flags mean, but maybe somebody of you knows and explains it to me. But yeah, the goal is Kerala. Kerala is supposed to be beautiful. So we're doing that right now. So fascinating, I did now 24 kilometers and I'm still not 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 even close to out of the city. So insane, super massive. And uh, I asked my friend uh, Ananya and she said that Bengaluru is the new name and Mangalore is actually the old name. So many cities here, 
Uh, they re renamed many ooh. <laughs> renamed many cities like also Mumbai is also Bombay so it's also two names and there's all these different names for cities it's a little bit confusing for a silly tourist like me but uh, we'll get there so see now it's red now it's green okay I was wondering why nobody stopped yeah. Look at that. So this is because of the holiday today. It's all over the city. But it is exhilarating right riding through these towns. Like look you have no control over it. can just go just have to go with the flow just see what happens I thought it might be interesting for you if I film a little bit while riding through the town even though you know me I don't really usually not you don't really learn a lot <laughs> I'm, not, I'm not like reading up a lot on stuff I just experience it my way because if you want to know something about Bengaluru, you, can, you might as well go to Google and check it out. You don't need me to tell you about the history. But I do learn one or the other thing. And uh, I'll make sure to share it with you always. Like I said, I want to go to the coast and the next charging station. From now it's 230 kilometers. But it says it will still take me four hours, so it will be four until I be there. So uh, yeah, I might just charge for one hour and then see, check for an Airbnb somewhere cool and see what I'm going to do then. No, nope, no other plans, no other plans. I think I have to go up here. Oh, it might make sense. Oh boy. I'm not quite sure, but I think to the right, this is a, a expressway and I think I'm not allowed on this one. So I'm just taking the, the one next to it now. So it's always not so clear if it's just a normal highway or not, but all the mopeds are on this road. So I might just stay on this road to my Zuru. Yep. Okay, I'm not sure really, oh look at that, yeah I was supposed to go on here, ah uh, no, no motorcycles, okay, no motorcycles allowed, okay, oh that will make my day even longer probably. Yeah. Yeah, but uh, can't do nothing about it. Ah, look at that mountains here. <laughs> cheepy cheepy. Uh, cheepy cheep. 
That's brilliant. The only thing is I cannot really uh, coast behind a bus on these trucks here. These trucks, I don't know. They're not really doing it for me. But boy, landscape. Brilliant again. Awesome. Two hundred and four kilometers. <laughs> yeah, I again highly underestimated the whole trip today. I thought I would be way, way, way quicker, but I also forgot to cross off the motorways. Uh, so that was uh, my fault. But yeah, making my way through to the charging station and towards the coast. I haven't really been stopping because stopping without charging feels to me like a little bit of a waste of time. So, and the distances here in India is really, if you want to do 200 kilometers on the motorcycle, yeah, it took me now yeah, four hours, over, nah, yeah, over four hours, four and a half hours. Uh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it's just all a little bit different here and all these little speed bumps I have to be really careful you cannot speed at all I might <laughs> yeah say hi <laughs> well yeah it's been lovely right the area reminds me more and more of Goa a lot of trees everywhere. Love that. I reckon it's gonna be really awesome in Kerala. Just have to see where I'm going to sleep tonight. Uh, but I want to make that one hour, 15 minutes now to the charger and then check for somewhere to sleep. I hope it's not going to be too late. But I should be fine. Should be fine. <laughs> it's quite ridiculous. <laughs> oh, fuck. <laughs> Oi, oi. <laughs> Elephant crossing? Oh, that would be so awesome if I see a wild elephant. That would be so good. So nice here. No people. Just nature. Awesome. Have a little bit of a 30 kilometer range, yeah, but still 33 kilometers to go. Oh, Let's see if I can do it. Coal area here, coal area. Slow down for wildlife, okay. I am up to invisible ground. Now gotta hold tiger reserve. That's what it's called here. Monkey party here. I, the path as I go. No elephant though. That would be, that would be just so uh, cool. would absolutely make my day. Oh, there's an elephant camp. All right. Okay. But yeah, they do say no, no sh oh, 
believe that. They do say no stopping here. Teagle Elephant Camp. Okay. Coolio. Uh, yeah, that is interesting now. I don't know where that charger is, but 900 meters from here? Oh, it's, uh, it's quite interesting. Okay, no entry there. Here. Okay, oh, there's a golf, golf resort. All right. I was charging at a golf resort. That could be worse. Probably have food here as well. That would be awesome. Houses here too. Maybe I can find somewhere to sleep as well. Zero percent. But there's still a little bit left in the tank. But the charger better work. That charger better work. I think it's in here. Hi. I'm looking for a car charger. I'm looking for an electric charger. The for cars. Tata power. The Tata power, yeah for plugging in the bike. Battery, electric, is it here? It's here, yeah. Can I come in? This way? All right, okay, thank you. Long legs. Whew. Uh, yeah, the entrance is here. Okay. Yeah. Hello. I need to go to the car charger. The um, car charger. Plugging in. Electric. Cool. Oh, luckily I saw it already. It's always hard to explain. Touching, yeah? Oh, very good. Whew. And it's on. Okay. So he's plugged in. Now I'm gonna check out if there's a, maybe a restaurant here that would be lovely. Uh, they might even have rooms here. Fancy here. 
There might also be the relaxing music in the background, but it is pretty nice here. Pretty cool. And I found an Airbnb not far from here, and it's only 10 bucks. And it's so nice, so beautiful. I can't stay here because a room is a hundred bucks a night, so that's not quite in the budget. But I'm gonna have some food now, and then, yeah, I'll be going to my homestay. It's gonna be lovely. It's not far, it's not far anymore. Ah, cool day, cool day. Uh. Okay, so I did finish eventually, and that is now uh, almost 90 rupee for almost 4 kilowatt hours. Plus the food was about 800 rupee, so that makes it about 10 bucks for a little one hour, 20 minutes stay here. Remember when I was in Pushkar? In Pushkar and I paid, what, 600 rupee for a little bit of charging. Right, let's get out of here. Off to the Airbnb. Cork, that is quite, quite the area here. Wish I would have seen a tiger. happening. Uh, okay, 5.2 kilometers. That old building. Wow. <laughs> it's quite cool. I remember holiday today. Orange. I'm actually wearing the right helmet for that day today. <laughs> People might think I'm celebrating. Oh yeah, here it is. That's lovely. Cool. good okay so wearing saffron color I think that is that uh, symbolizes the quest for knowledge of Godhead mm, worn by monks this is the color of bliss and joy 
deep joy. Here it says, orange is the color of connection, a sense of community, belonging and social aspect of being. Well, I guess that is my lucky helmet then. Good choice. All right, tomorrow I will check out the whole area, I guess, and I'll bring you guys along. So don't forget to subscribe and I'll see you in the next video. Ciao.